The NFER test analysis tool is very useful for entering your pupils' current test results in order to analyse areas they may need additional study. It is also useful for tracking a pupil's progress across the whole time they have been taking NFER tests. In order to do this, it is recommended you import your pupil's historical test data. To begin, select the group of pupils you would like to import the data for. Then click the Import Results button. Click the Download Template button here. You will only be able to import results from this template and not any other spreadsheet. A list of pupils in the selected year group will be on the left and all available test papers will be listed along the top. Enter the date the test was taken and the score achieved in the relevant boxes for your pupils. Any pupils who did not sit the test should be left blank. Where tests have multiple papers, the score entered should be the sum of all papers for that assessment. For instance, Year 3 Summer Maths should be the combined score of Paper 1, Paper 2 and the arithmetic paper. When you have completed all the columns you wish, save the spreadsheet to your computer and return back to the online hub. Log back in to upload. Click the browse button and select your saved file. Press upload. If you have included scores for tests where data has already been added through the system on Enter by Pupil, Enter by Question or Enter by Total pages, you will receive a warning message telling you these scores will not be imported. If you have included scores for tests where data has been previously imported, you will receive a warning message asking you to confirm you wish to overwrite the previously imported data. To check for any data that hasn't been imported, click the Download Failed Results button and open the downloaded spreadsheet. This lists all pupils and tests that haven't been imported and has comments for the reason why. These are some potential reasons why. For a printable list of reasons, please download the full user guide available on the support page. If scores haven't been imported, Depending on the reason, you can amend your import sheet on your computer and re-upload, or you can enter the scores manually through the system. For more information on entering data and the test analysis tool in general, please take a look at some more of our videos.